94 migrants escape suffocation in truck in Mexico. Authorities in Mexico said that at least 94 migrants had to bash their way out of a suffocating freight trailer abandoned on a highway in the steamy Gulf Coast state of Veracruz, in the southern Mexico state of Chiapas, which borders Guatemala. Yet another group of migrants continued demanding temporary visas that would permit them to travel across Mexico. They were still in the town of Huizla on Thursday after leaving Tabachula earlier this week, saying they can't wait months for slow immigration paperwork in Tabachula. Carlos Enrique Escalante, the head of the state migrant attention office, said migrants had to break holes in the freight container to get out. Some apparently threw the roof. Some were injured when they leaped from the roof of the trailer. But their injuries didn't include any broken bones and were not considered life-threatening. He also said local residents near the town of Acayucan heard the noise and helped open the freight container. A much larger number of migrants were believed to have been abroad and fled after escaping. But the 94 migrants from Guatemala, Honduras, and El Salvador were turned over to immigration authorities. The discovery of the trailer Wednesday recalled the tragedy in San Antonio, Texas, on June 27th, when 53 migrants died because they had been left in a sweltering freight truck. The medical examiner's office has identified potentially 34 of 51 victims. The county medical examiner has also asked for assistance from medical examiner offices in neighboring counties due to the large number of victims. 48 people died on the scene and two died at hospitals. The federal law enforcement officials told on Tuesday, noting the toll is preliminary. This is BBS News. Thank you and goodbye.